but college is for either really high flyers or lazy and lazy people. Tell me why you say that. Why? Tell me. I'm because a, I'm a high flyer, right? Yeah. What's a sacrifice when you go to school? Sacrifice is time because you're getting older and you could actually be making money while you're there. Money, of course, because exactly. you're spending all your parents' money or your money or some bank money. Exactly. You know, all kinds of sacrifice. See, think about that. See, that, hey, those are down. Those are downfalls, quote unquote, yeah. of going to college. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, we, and, and this is something that I think we as humans, all we think about is money. Mm -hmm. Money is something that we need right. and we want right. all the time. Right. A lot of people, they lose out on being able to get jobs because they're in school. Right. Even though in the long run, the long run is I'm able to probably get something even better. Mm -hmm. It's still, we still in a position where we lose out. Hey, college students always eating ramen noodles. Right. Because why? They don't have no money. <laughs> so a lot of them... In they Jamaica, we eat, uh, we eat uh, mackerel and white rice. Exactly. And what a lot of people do, they drop out of school right. so that they could go work mm -hmm. to make money. So it's, it's, it's really a push and pull in anything you do, any business you get into, mm -hmm. you have to know what you're doing and understand that, hey, I may fall off here, but I may win here. Or I may, I may be good for a, for a long time, right. but I have to make, make preparations for when things are bad. This might be a bad analogy, and I may not mean this in the truest sense, but college is for either really high flyers or lazy and lazy people. Tell me why you say that. Why? Tell me. I'm because an, I'm an a high flyer, right? Yeah. You want to be in the best position at all times. Indeed. You want to start a job off making a decent amount. You ain't trying to really work your way from the janitor. Yeah. High flyers ain't really want. You're wasting all that time. No, no. So you say, get let me get a degree time. because I know I can start at forty thousand. Yeah. Right. Now that's the logic behind high flyer. Now the lazy person. Yeah. They don't have the dedication to go work their way up the ladder or build some business from from what do you call it? Something strap, bootstrap from a your business. Boot, buy a bootstrap, right? Yeah. Bootstrap a business and learn YouTube and all this stuff you're talking yeah. about, and then build this empire where they didn't they they became successful and without college and Indeed. you lazy, you ain't got that type of drive. So what you need to do is try to get some education. So that you could get a stable job, yes. work a nice nine to five, yes. and get a pension. Yeah. <laughs> because you <laughs> ain't true. got the heart to get your make your own pension yeah. over your lifetime. So don't go try being an entrepreneur. Yeah. Because you lazy. Yeah. We can't make and then happen. It could be a little middle ground. It's the yeah. people who like security. I think I kinda like in the middle. Yeah. I like security, but then I also don't want to depend on a job. I also like to do my own stuff and yeah. make my own money but then I like having a job that I could fall back on yeah. if my business ain't popping. Pop yeah, you know yeah, I, mean? I got you. So I like in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been there. I've been there. I and, and truth be told, I love the idea of having that cushion, mm. that work, having that job as a cushion. Yeah, but I sure. also like the thrill making my own way mm. one thing that I have always appreciated about myself is I've been a go-getter right and in doing that I feel like I've never really had to depend on a job right. like I mean obviously you need money mm -hmm. but I've never really said oh my life is gonna end if I don't have a job right. because I've been the kind of person okay maybe I need to make some money let me put a proposal together and let me go approach this company but you didn't learn that stuff. You learned that stuff on YouTube. No. How you learn that stuff? That was an innate feeling. Mm. True. Uh, from I was a teen, I've always been, I could say, trying to be my own person. Mm. Um, I'm an only child. Right. So all I know is Alden. All I, I'm, I, I'm an only child. My mother's only son, only yeah. child, and she's done a great job and instilling some things in me she is she is a teacher right and so all i've known is her she's and you know it's funny i was never a troublesome kid mm. i was always as far as i as far as i know i mean i was mischievous right but as far as i know i was always interested in stuff 
like I would read books and just learn all the time and picking up books there trying to figure out this not the next thing but I always wanted to do my own thing mm -hmm. not to, not that I don't like um, um, authority but it's just a feeling of having your own right. it's just a feeling of doing what you want to do and you love it and you and you 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 just appreciate what you're doing and I think that entrepreneurship um, 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 spirit I don't right. want to call it a spirit but that entrepreneurship quality yeah. is something that could really make or break you right as a person right. it can make or break you because not everybody is 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 built for that entrepreneurship life no nope. you can have high days you can have months when you're making thousands and thousands of dollars and then you have times when months pass and you have made no money do you recommend that for like a regular university student or someone i recommend it for anyone anyone I recommend it for a student. Mm -hmm. If you are a student in high school, right. I think that's something you can learn because it's a way to generate money. It teaches you statistics. Mm -hmm. It teaches you patterns and trends and things of that nature.